Hey everybody, it's Ashley, Carolina Trailer Sales, carolinatrailersales.com. We're located in Colfax, North Carolina. We are by appointment only, and you can reach me at 828-773-4500. So this is a 2000 model Silver Star, all aluminum, three horse. It is six nine wide, seven tall. It is a weekender. So I'm going to show you this side first. Only thing I can really point out is it's missing a plastic hubcap there. It's just missing one. But no dings. Uh, fenders are good. Everything's good on this side. It does have electric electric hookup, 30 amp there, and water hookup. Okay. I'm going to kind of come around the front. Um, these are super nice trailers. Um, every time I get a Silver Star, they sell very well and quickly. Um, they're very much like four stars. They're built very nicely, and the older ones are obviously better built than the new stuff. So, a uh, hydraulic, not a hydraulic jack, excuse me, electric jack, stainless nose. Does have full running boards. Does have an awning. I will. Um, Full disclosure on the awning, we've patched it. It does have some holes um, and we've patched it. It will make it a season, but you will eventually need to get a new awning skin. So everything works, it functions, the arms all, all works great. It does have an escape door, three drop windows. Um, on this side of the trailer, we've got a little bit of a boo-boo here. The fender's kind of peeled, but not bad. Pointing that out. It's got 50-50 back doors, a rear, uh, full rear bumper here in good shape. Um, so, you'll notice it's missing a saddle rack. It does not have a saddle rack. I'm not exactly sure what, what happened, but what they did is put a extra water tank and a water pump in the back. You'll see that basin right here. Um, that's actually for the cowboy shower that you actually put here in the back. And that, of course, is the manual arm to raise it up if you were to need it. Um, so, what this person did is she put her tack in the first stall. So, full disclosure, it does not have um, a saddle rack. I think a saddle rack could be put in it. You could take out that water pump. Um, it clearly had a saddle rack at one point. Um, it just currently does not have a saddle rack. Horse box is in amazing shape for a 2000. There's actually no kicks, no scrapes. The rubber's all good. It's fully lined and insulated in here. Um, it's got roof vents, padded dividers. All the padding's good. It's got a nice, huge, solid um, lower divider. So solid gate there. It's a lot, a lot nicer than having the one that just attaches on the bottom. Um, Cowboy shower is a nice cowboy shower. It's got all the little hooks in the ceiling that you put your shower curtain up. Nice light back here. And actually that light has a dimmer on it. Um, the RV guy pointed that out to me. So sliders on the rear. Again, the horse box. Let me kind of go back to regular. Um, excellent, excellent condition. This is actually a great trailer. Um, it's in excellent condition for its age. And it's got quite a neat little um, living quarters area in the front. Um, which I'm getting ready to show you. But anyway, uh, as far as the horse box, um, there's no issues whatsoever. There's absolutely nothing that I can complain about this trailer in the horse box. All right, so moving on around. Um, another thing that's nice on this trailer is it's got the fully extruded sides. Um, that makes it really nice. It's stronger. You've got the horses tied on the side. You've got some extra stability there with that. Okay, it does have a camper door. So, um, as far as short wall on this trailer, this is gonna be about a six foot short wall. Like I said, it, it's, it's a pretty neat, um, let me get this door shut. Sorry guys. Um, it's a pretty neat interior. So it's got a little dinette. That little dinette does make a little bed. These are all real wood cabinets. You know, somebody could paint them if they wanted, change out the hardware, but honestly, it's not bad. Got a little sink back here. 
your hot water heater, little counter that space there. Cabinets everywhere. I mean, it's it's got cabinets galore. Um, there's a mirror here, and then this is this is two cabinets as well. Spin around here. We got more counter space, which I really like. It's got an electric refrigerator there underneath. Um, you know, it's got drawers, which is super nice. Cabinets here, cabinets above, cabinets up in the nose. Cool thing is, is um, it's got a TV and you can turn it to where you can watch it from the couch or you can turn it to watch it from the bed area. Kind of neat. Um, it does have a fan up here. It does have a little ladder, which I'm on. Uh, let me kind of spin around. All right, so now you can kind of see um, the layout. It's a good size. It's got that big bay window. It's got a curtain rod there, so you can put a curtain of your choice. Walk through door to go to your cowboy shower. Air conditioning. Does not have heat, but you can put a small um, thermostat heater in here, and you should have no problem. Oh, gotta get out and be on the phone at the same time. <laughs> Sorry. All right, so 2000 Silver Star, all aluminum, three horse. I would put this one in excellent condition. This is a great trailer, great starter trailer for this coming spring. Get ready to go trail riding. Show whatever. All right. Thanks guys. Carolina Trailer Sales, carolinatrailersales.com. You guys have a great day.